new Taylor Swift music? What? I don't know what's going on. This year is just, I don't know. But I am all for a new Taylor Swift album. And that is something that we have. We have a brand new album called Folklore, the lead single of which is called Cardigan. That's what we're gonna be watching the music video for and listening to what's going on musically today uh, and seeing what's going on vocally as well. I'm just kind of letting the shockwaves move through me of what is what is actually happening. This is the quickest that there's ever been a kind of drop between Taylor writing the music and then it coming out. So very personal music for her, I guess, and very right now what she's thinking. And I'm just super excited to see what we're going to get. Are you ready? Here we go. That is a rickety old piano. Oh, Listen to those drums. Breathy vocals. When, oh, wait, I got the lyrics up in preparation for this, but I think, yeah, when you were young, they assume you know nothing. That, that is quite a poignant thing to say. Quite a different vocal from Taylor. I like that sound. Oh, she is going in. Okay, so the piano is old and rickety. She's looking a bit down. She's getting into this new section of the song, and at that point, the gold is coming out of the piano as well. So I like that she's moving through sections visually, but also musically. Oh, that's the same melody ah, that's in the piano. Wow! Wait, so she's coming out of the piano stool, of the piano she just went into. What does it mean? What does it mean? Um, what's going on lyrically here? I knew you dancing in your Levi's, drunk under a streetlight. I knew you hand under my sweatshirt. Okay, Tyler. Okay. Baby kiss it better. Uh, and when I felt like I was an old cardigan under someone's bed, you put me on and said I was your favorite. That is, that's such a clever lyric because it's sort of looking at how Taylor has felt maybe used or used up and someone else has made her feel brand new again. Under someone's bed. Very breathy, layered vocal there as well. There's a um, an organ sound going on throughout the whole of this. It's like ah, it sort of shimmers throughout, and because we have the drums doing a kind of clippity clappity, I don't know how else to describe it. Thing, everything layered together is very, very interesting. Very interesting. I think there's a very soft octave on there. Oh yeah. Visually, that piano with the waterfall is beautiful, but I also like that this whole song has this boom, pacad, like this sort of circular movement. I don't know if that makes sense. That's how my body wants to move listening to it. Once in 20 lifetimes. That chord change is nice. Yeah, all these vocals are super breathy, but so the lyrics there, your heartbeat on the high line once in 20 lifetimes. I'm trying to ascertain what that means. Your heartbeat on the high line once in 20 lifetimes. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. If you know what that means, please tell me. I'm sure it is very obvious and I'm just completely missing it. But the imagery really does match how I was thinking, folklore, this, it really does match. Beautiful. Oh, and in this section, that whole thing, oh, I like those vocals that were coming in, that whole thing had that movement of 
I think as one of the synths is doing that and so dynamically you get this push and pull constantly which is really nice and nice to have that instrumental breakdown listen to all the vocal layers though Oh wow, oh! Okay, so, 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 this is making me think. She stepped back into the bit that was where the rickety piano was, but actually it's like she stepped into a new section of her life. I feel like we're going through different points in her life where she's felt certain ways, and at this point, she's she's just out to sea feels like she's drowning too much is going on yeah very interesting visual that is so so catchy ah and the piano is her lifeboat writing is her lifeline i like all these layers of vocals Okay, so different lyrics again, let me just check. That, I like that new melody. Da -na 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 -na. I knew you'd linger like a tattoo kiss. I knew you'd haunt all of my what ifs. What is going on? The smell of smoke would hang around this long. This is very descriptive for it to be ambiguous, you know? <laughs> got a vendetta there. Oh, it's actually giving me goosebumps. Oh, that's nice. And now she's crawling back into the lid of the piano. I'm getting confused about what each of the things means, but I know it's moving into a different part of her life. I think that's what it is. So when she goes back into this bit and we're at the end of the song, this is how she's feeling right now. I think. I've still got the goosebumps, by the way. I think it's the mix of the imagery and the song. Oh, she's going back to... Oh, more goosebumps! <laughs> the original place. Wait! Wait, 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 but if she's saying when I felt like an old cardigan, you put me on, but she's putting the cardigan on, is, is this song talking about her being her own best friend and learning to love herself through all of these different changes? Plot twist. Ooh. Now you can really hear a lot more of the stuff exposed. She looks really vulnerable in this clip but also kind of accepting in a way. Oh, Taylor, 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 Taylor. That has really got to me. That's really got to me. Wow, what is the album gonna be like? I know loads of you will have already listened to it. I have not, I'm saving it for a reaction, uh, but wow, I'm really taken with that. I feel like this is a really personal, introspective, the kind of the right move music musically for Taylor right now it has elements of lover in a way but it is just totally different it really is but very nicely arranged musically everything fits together like a you know it's like a, a jigsaw everything's together and vocally she's got these breathy moments these more vocals that have more conviction lots of dynamic change I really like it Mmm, I'm very different, very different. Okay, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments box down below. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, please do hit that subscribe button, turn on the notifications, become part of our family here. And oh, I have uh, my very first YouTube live tomorrow. I'm doing a Q&A, so please do bring your questions and I will answer them. And uh, that's at 3 p.m. British summer time, so please do join me for that and in the meantime you can find me on twitter and instagram at nina underscore schofield you can find links to my music and to my wizio page where i can help you with your singing in the description box down below alongside a link to my spotify playlist as well and i will look forward to seeing you guys very very soon love you bye